Hey guys, so uh, this is the um, classic Turtles um, turtle lamp. Um, so I got this in the mail, um, ordered through walmart.com. Um, was like basically this enterprise, which I think is like $35. Um, I never seen this in stores. I don't know why, just I've seen party wagons here and there, but I've never seen this in stores. And I was really wanting this because I was wanting to um, display this with, I don't know, hopefully in the ceiling, but we'll see how that works. But anyways, so this is the, I'm assuming the front of the package. Up top we get kind of like a picture of them, and then Turtle Blunt, Wacky Attack Aircraft. Um, on the side, it's just kind of the same stuff. Close over 30 inches long. Um, other side, same thing. And on the back, we get a picture of what it looks like. Um, I'm really hoping there's some mounting support here. Um, not sure how it's going to work. And then down here, we just get like a picture of what it's supposed to look like with the classic figures. Um, <clears throat> I don't, I don't have those figures. I have like the NECA animated figures. Um, that may change. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to try to display this with those. Um, so, um, I know some differences like I've heard like with the old blimp, which is crazy expensive now. But like this part's changed and this part's changed a little bit, not drastically, but, um, but anyways, I'm gonna get out of the package. I was like, I kind of show you what it is and then I gotta blow it up. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like whenever I open it up and just what you, what you see whenever you open the box. Okay. That's nice. <clears throat> All right. So I just kind of want to bring everything out. Um. So I guess the main thing is this is the blimp itself. Um, it comes wrapped in like a, a paper or something like that. Um, this looks like where you blow in the um, inflate it. Um, looks pretty big. I mean, it's, it says up to 30 inches long, which is two and a half feet. So um, yeah. And these are like the, what you call it? Color things. There's four of them in here, so that's what those look like. It's like they pop in somewhere, so it looks like I don't think this is the part, but like that's kind of what they would pop, I guess. Well, maybe that is it. I don't know. I guess one's gonna flay it off, see what's up with it. Um, so there's four of those, and then we got this thing, which kind of um, I don't know, I'm trying to look at the instructions to kind of see. So, I have this like this piece right here, maybe. So, it attaches to the seat. So I guess that makes it where they can, more turtles can sit. So I guess I would attach here like that. So, oh, it looks like it should be upside down though. So I guess it would be like that. I don't know. I might have to read the instructions pretty easily and make sure I follow this correctly. Because do not use the air inflate, do not open inflate. So it looks like you attach everything before you actually inflate it. So step one is attaching the wings and attaching the or fins, I'm sorry. Uh, and attach the undercarriage, all this stuff, and then you just blow it up. And this back part kind of works as the uh, propulsion, but also um that's kind of weird. It looks like that wheel would turn because it's got a screw in there, but it don't. Um, but I guess that's mainly the cockpit part here. And then these are just, and these roll up like when I'm kind of popped out. So you can just roll it up like that. 
That's where the hooks go. Um, okay, well, there's not much else to it but to put it together and see how it looks. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right, guys, so I've got it out or inflated and put together, and that's pretty much it. So, yeah, these pieces right here, you had to pop them in. Um, some of these were kind of rough, like my finger is, I can't really see it, but like, had to kind of press it again. You know, I do definitely recommend uh, doing it because when it's deflated, you have to push it against there. Um, down here at the bottom, um, this one was like that too. So, it kind of has these push pins. Um, there's like one on each corner. Um, and these hooks just pop in. I get to sit. And it sits pretty good. Like, uh, these, it's kind of like, it looks like wheels. There's one on the back here too. So it can kind of, it don't really roll, but it just, you know, sits. So, um, what else? I mean, it's like basically designed to like just show all this stuff here. So none of this stuff like just drawn. Um, turn around real quick. Oops. Um, now yeah, you inflate it here. That took a while to inflate. I just did it by mouth, I guess. Um, See, got that there. Okay, seems pretty good. Um, both sides look about the same, so and it's a pretty tough, um, like a really good beach ball or something like that. So, it is had been not over inflate, so like I didn't inflate it all the way, so you can kind of see like there's like a little ridges here and stuff so i just kind of left that and i left this poking out too because it's kind of tight putting it back in there um what i'm gonna do next is i'm gonna try to put my neck of turtles on it and just see how that looks all right so um i just brought one out brought donnie he's mainly the pilot anyways i guess he's the one that made it too but anyways um so it kind of shows here like how it works, like the hooks, they kind of go through like the straps in the back and then you can bring them up. So I just want to try that real quick. Um, so this is, yeah, this is the NECA animated figure, but he does have a strap here. So I'm wondering if that will just go in there. And, go uh, this thing real quick. there and then hook him through the back and see if it'll actually lift him. So let's see. So let's see. So. Yeah, it doesn't hook in, so I kind of figure, like, so maybe want the regular turtles for that, I'm not sure. So, like, it hooks, but it's like, I don't know, this doesn't have a lot of give. I mean, maybe in there, but then it'll be dangling kind of funny, and there's nowhere else, so. Um, as far as fitting in the hooks, these do bend pretty well, so. You can definitely sit in there like that. So you could do that, no problem. And all these hooks are the same, so the same on the other side too. Um, you know, put it in the driver's seat. Um, this thing tilts back and forth. So, I'll sit them in there. So 
That kind of works. Try to get that in the focus, but. Yeah, you can sit them in there and. Let's see. So this kind of leans back a little bit, but that's about as far back as it goes. So it works with anime turtles. Um, let me get this stuff in here. Like it looks a little tight to get both hands in there. It's just, I don't know, be a little scrunched. Um, so yeah, technically it works for this. Um, so yeah, let's see, I'm just kind of sitting normal. So we got a staff just in case it needs it and drive with one hand. Um, yeah, so it works. Um, there was one thing I didn't get with mine was, let me bring this out real quick. So up here on top, there was no like little latches for that to be there. Um, so like where you can hang it. So it shows it on the box. Let me just bring that out real quick. So yeah, mine didn't have this there either. I'm not sure that's like a common thing, but that's where it would hang. Um, so probably what I'll have to do is just go underneath, maybe some fish line or something like that, and try to like wrap around through here. Cause there is a gap there to uh, bring it up. And I'll show you that real quick. So when I'm, under, when I'm underneath here, you can see there's like a little bit of a gap here. And I'm thinking like I could run some fishing line through there and hang it up, but yeah, again, there's no like straps right there for it to hang out. I don't see anything or I'll search the box again, but I didn't see nothing. So but anyways, um, yeah, I mean, it was cool looking, um, you know, the anime turtles working there pretty good. No issues. Just takes a little time to piece it together. My finger's a little sore from, again, pushing these little, let me try to get it, these little plastic pins up here. So, and then blowing it up, obviously. So, but yeah, it's uh, pretty cool. I don't know what I'd give it out of 10. I guess time would tell, but uh, right now I'd probably say like 8.5 if I give it a score. So, all right. Well, thanks for watching.